Hey everyone, this is a quick video explaining how to get scrolling text or just pop-up text on your live stream when using XSplit and uh, StreamTip. So what, you wanna go, what you're going to want to do is go get StreamTip, go get XSplit, download them, uh, make accounts, just get, get them all working. Um, open up your StreamTip, sign in. You're going to go to downloads and you're going to download this. It's called Stream Tip Alerter. So after you've downloaded that, you're going to open up Stream Tip Alerter. I got it opened up right here. Watch the video. It'll show you how to set it up properly. I'm not going to because it'll compromise my Stream Tip if I open that up. Uh, I just don't feel like editing this video, to be honest with you. Um, so that'll pop up. You put in the configuration that you need. Um, what you're going to do when you go in there, you're going to put in the, your Stream Tip uh, ID which is what, what will compromise my stream tip. That's why I'm not opening it. You're going to put in that. You're going to put in another number that you need to. And then uh, you're going to go configure your settings in in stream tip alerter. And there's uh, stream tips that are called uh, recent tips, top tips, top tips list, and, top and recent tips list. So those you're going to go edit, and you're going to put sounds in them if you want, or you're going to change what they're supposed to show. But after you've done that and that's all set up, you're going to open up your XSplit Broadcaster. Uh, this is just going to take a minute to load. You're going to log into your XSplit Broadcaster. If you haven't paid, you got to wait the 10 seconds, of course. So you wait the 10 seconds. Um, just for this video, I'm just going to use Screen Region just because I'm, I'm lazy. I don't want to use my Game Capture Card. That's probably because I'm actually using my Game Capture Card to record this right now, actually. So you wait the 10 seconds if you're free for this to go away. Hit continue. And now what you want to do is you're going to go add more sources. And you're going to add or you're going to install the plugin called title. So once you've installed that, you can go back to add. You can go add title. And then this window right here will pop up. First thing you want to do is you want to hit remote text update. One second. So what this means is that it'll... Con It'll just continually uh, refresh the URL we're about to put in here every second rather than every 10 seconds. So as soon as someone donates, it'll pop up on your screen if that's what you're using your scrolling text for, uh, which is what we're doing this tutorial for. But you're going to go into your documents. You're gonna, th this will be here after you've done con configuring, configurating Stream Tip Alerter. So you hit Stream Tip. And now you get this URL right here. So you click in your URL box, copy. Control C, paste, Control V, and you're gonna forward slash, or yeah, backward slash, backward slash. That's underneath your backspace on your keyboard if anyone's trying to find it. You're gonna go back here, and now, depending on which one you want, that's what you're gonna type in. So we're gonna say, we're gonna do the top tipper. So it's tip dash top, tip dash top, and since it's a text file, you're going to go .txt. And then hit OK. Box right here pops up. I don't know why the fuck it's got all that in it, but sure. Make it the size you want. In order to change the size, I'd go to Title, right-click it, hit Layout, and change it using the width and whatnot, because it'll change... There you go. Change where the $5 is and all that kind of stuff. Change the height. Just use that. It makes things a lot easier on you. Move it over to where it needs to be. Um, we're going to add this title differently. because If you want it on the right side of your page, just do it like that. If you want it on the left side of your page, I'll show you how to get it on the left side of your page real quick. So you're going to go add title. Same thing. Remote. One second. Control V. Forward slash. This is for the, uh, or backslash, sorry. This is, we're going to say this one's a list and we want it to scroll. You're going to hit scrolling, slow speed, normal speed. I don't really care which one you want to do. Uh, tip dash rec list dash recent, I believe it is, dot txt because it's a text document. Make sure tip list recent, right? Tip dash list dash recent. Yep. Okay. So we put that on. Now say you want it on the right side of your screen. You're going to go align right. Okay. It'll pop up on the right side this time, though. 
Once again, con configure the layout using this. It just makes your life a lot easier. Changing the height will also change the size. Bigger, smaller, it'll change the size of the text. So you change it to the certain size you want, and now it just starts scrolling by. And there you go. There's the scroll. So 80 blah, 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 donated $5, apparently. Um, I hope that helped. Like, subscribe, comment. If you have any questions, just comment. I'll try and get back to you as quick as possible. Um, check out my Twitch account, Potsy24. Check out my YouTube account, Potsy24. Um, hope everyone has